Hello and welcome to Think Make Share. Today I've got another engraving video for you. This time round I'll be engraving a pendant with the four initials and also three pocket watches. They also want initials on the back of those. So let's get started. So the first one I'm actually going to do the pendant first. Get that out of the way. So let's get the machine set up. So in order for the pendant I need to put in the right jaws. I tend to use these ones. So let's get that put on. Machine. Let's turn that on right. Thank you. Let's get the pendant out. So this is the round pendant. Let's have a look. Let's get that put into the machine. Okay, that's all centered. Thank you. That's secure. Let's get the measurements put into the machine. Right, the measurements of this is 18, 18 all round. So, what I'll do is on the computer, I'll put that as 18, 18. On the border of two, that's fine. Okay, right, and then the issues they want is all in capitals. And it's, uh, it's D dot A dot K dot I. And they want that in a block. So what I'll do is let's adjust the size first. So if I go for five, um, let's do a Roman three line. Yeah, that looks nice. Actually, you know what? Let's get the border to one. Give us a bit more space. That's slightly better. Let's adjust the size down slightly. To four point five. Here we go. And uh, let's get that sent down to the machine. Okay, that's been set down to the machine. Let's get the engraving. Secure. Start. Got all the rotary, slightly deeper. Beautiful, that's done. So what I'll do is let's take this out the machine. What I'll do is I'll polish this after I've done that. So this is how it's coming out the machine so far. Oh, let me see that. Let's put that down actually. After I've polished it, I'll take all the little blemishes off and hopefully it should look nice in here. Let's go on to the pocket watches. Right, onto the pocket watches. So let's get the measurements for this pocket watch. So that is 35 by 35. So let me adjust this one to 35 by 35. And let's change that to two. Right, check that out. They want something different on these. Right, let's get what they want on these. So on the first one, they want all in caps A, M, G. She wants it nice and big, so I'll take that up a size. Uh, you know what, let's take it to five. Okay, it's fine. That looks pretty nice, and I'll leave the pointers the same. So let's get to the machine. Right, for these pocket watches, I need to change over the jaws. So I'll take these ones off. Um, Put on the ones with the pocket watch, which are these ones here. Make sure they're on there securely. Yeah. Let's get the pocket watch put in. Put the watch. Right, with the pocket watches, because of the one well, on the top, the, the clicker, obviously I can't put that in the machine this way, so what I tend to do with this one is I'll put it in sideways, and what I'll do is I'll, um, I'll crack that on the machine so it knows to engrave the right way, and I'll show you how that's done in a bit. Let's get this put in. Make sure that is nice and secure. Open it up a bit more. There we go. So I'm doing this by one hand, so bear with me. Right, let's make sure that's all square. Seems pretty square to me. Right, these pocket watches, it comes with a film to help it get scratched, so let's take the film off before we engrave. It's got plastic covering. Let's put that to one side. Okay. Make sure that is all secure in there. Okay, now let's get this engraved. So, for that engraving, I'm going to engraving. And obviously, I need to change this because of where I put the watch. So, that one will be engraving left to right. So, okay, run. And that should be sent down to the machine. Hear the beep. Keep it sent. Come down. There we go. 
So, stop that. Alright, one more thing with these watches. Because there's a hinge on there, the top it actually moves. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to hold that steady while it's engraving. So, start. So let's get that out of the machine. Right, so that is. Go, A and G. So that one's done. Let's put this one to one side and get the rest ones done. Hopefully, the rest ones are all the same size. So all I need to do is just change the text to those. And uh, I'll put them the same way. So the next one is A, I, G. This one's four. Let's send that, send that down as well. Okay, run. Right, that's been set down, so let's get the second pocket watch put into the vise. Okay, put the second one in, make sure the plastic thing is off, so I'll take that off. Just let me check that is correct. A, J, I, G. Correct, and it's been set down. And, look, it's been set down to the machine. Yep, it's coming down. So, let's get press start on this. Okay, that one's done, so let's take that one out. That is the second one. Let's get the last one done. So the last one is to say, uh, let's have a look. So it's N J G. N J G. Sheeny. Okay, run. Let's get that done. Okay, let's get the other one strapped in the last one. Okay. This is the last one put into the machine. Make sure we take the film off. There we go. And make sure it's secure. Let's get started. Okay, that looks nice. Let's get that one pulled out. There we go. And that's the last one. Let's look at the finished products. So the first one was the pendant with E A K I, and then there were the three pocket watches. The first one was A M G, second A J I G, and the final one was N J G. They were quite nice. What I'll do is I'll get these packed up. Uh, thank you for watching. Think, make, share. See you in the next one. Bye.